Welcome to The Daily Devo. My name is Diana, and today we are talking about the fact that God knows more. I was one of those kids who really enjoyed learning how things work. Maybe you were too. Maybe do you remember the Mr. Rogers TV show where he took viewers behind the scenes at the Crayola factory to show the process of how coloring crayons were made? Or maybe for you, you enjoyed taking gadgets apart and putting them back together. Or maybe you enjoy a good documentary or a book that teaches how things work. Well, today in Job's conversation with God, God is going to ask Job if Job knows all the behind the scenes details about how everything in the world works. Let's take a listen. It's found in Job 38 verses 18 through 21. Here's what it says. Have you comprehended the vast expanses of the earth? God said, tell me if you know all this. What is the way to the abode of light? And where does darkness reside? Can you take them to their places? Do you know the path to their dwelling? Surely you know, for you were already born. You have lived so many years. Do you know what God is asking Job? He's essentially saying, Job, have you comprehended all of how life works and where the light goes and where it comes from? Have you comprehended? Do you know all the behind the scenes? That is the key question God is asking Job. God is asking Job if he's able to comprehend, understand, to know or fully know how everything in earth works and moves. Remember, by comparison, God is all-knowing. God's thoughts are not our own. That God is more knowledgeable, more brilliant, more creative, and more knowing than we are. What God is doing is he's trying to draw Job's attention up. Remember, Job is facing, facing a big loss and real grief. And in these verses, God's saying, Job, there are many additional questions on planet Earth that you do not fully comprehend either. Yet even though you don't know where light comes from or how it is sent places, you don't know all the specifics, you still trust God in those areas. God is reminding Job of this main point, that God knows fully the intricate details that we will never fully be able to grasp. So here's today's point for us. Might you and I, might we also trust God's comprehension in the areas of our own life when we can't fully understand or comprehend why something has happened or what comes next? Because we can count on the sturdy truth that God knows more. We can trust him and trust that he is good. Today, would you ponder the brilliance and competence of God? And as you do, it will grow your trust in him and your confidence in depending upon him. We'll see you next time.